The CAT High Wall Miner is an exceptional machine that produces high volumes of coal. This rugged, proven product often works in remote places and on tight benches. Safety is especially important for the four to five person crew operating on and around the machine. To keep the machine and the crew working at peak production levels, we've built important safety features into the HW300. This video is about the key safety features on the CAT High Wall Miner. Keeping eyes on the crew, the high wall in front of the machine and the immediate work environment is of utmost importance. Machine mounted lighting covers the entire machine and the surrounding work area. The cab operator has excellent line of sight to the crew and with the help of cameras pointed at key work areas can monitor high areas of interest including the entry of the drive, the conveyor and the coal offloading point. Inside the operator's cab the layout is practical, ergonomic and protective with laminated tinted safety glass that reduces glare and prevents shattering. The cab itself is FOP certified for falling object protection the ergonomically designed seat is equipped with a seat belt and is adjustable about three axes for comfort and provides accessibility to touch screens. If the crew is forced to evacuate the HW300 due to weather or other safety considerations and it becomes necessary to move the machine without placing an operator on board, the machine can be controlled using wireless access and trammed to a safer location. Strong and extensive work platforms with handrails provide security and protection when working above ground on the machine. When the machine is running and the hose reel is in use, lockable gates restrict access to the hose reel area. And all walk areas and steps have serrated grating for traction, helping prevent slips and falls by allowing water, mud and dirt to fall through key traffic zones. Team members communicate with two-way radios and speakers, and those adding or removing push beams use a pendant control to operate the second generation push beam transfer mechanism, PTM2, providing space and limiting their engagement with moving equipment. At no time is a crew member underneath a suspended push beam. To ensure safety when it's time to move the heavy push beams, Positive lock lift hooks are used to securely hold the load and the push beams are connected together with two simple pins. No high voltage or fluid connections are required. An ergonomically designed extraction tool helps remove the pins and keeps crew from having to bend and lift throughout the shift. In the event of an emergency, the HW300 is designed to shut down immediately. You'll find emergency stop switches, also called e-stops, strategically located around the machine. Conditions that will automatically shut down the machine include excessive methane detected at the mine's entry, if hydraulic or water tank levels drop below safe levels, if hydraulic fluid or coolant temperatures exceed maximum set points, or if flow meters indicate an inadequate amount of coolant is reaching key water-cooled motors. If there's an emergency shutdown, terminating power to the machine, or a hydraulic hose failure, key load-bearing cylinders have been fitted with load locks to hold the cylinder in place and maintain its position. Critical hoses, such as the ones connected to the anchoring drills and PTM2 lift, are protected by Kevlar sleeves. If the machine loses power for whatever reason, an uninterruptible power supply, or UPS, ensures the machine stops safely, that important data is stored, and emergency lighting activates to help the team safely evacuate. These lights can also be timed in non-emergency situations to stay on for a set period after the operator shuts down the machine, providing a well-lit exit. Air quality around the machine is also a safety concern. The HW300 has dust suppression at the power head, the coal discharge, and along chain conveyor transition points. The cab and key compartments with sensitive equipment are slightly pressurized to keep dust out, and an exhaust fan inside electrical and hydraulic compartments helps with airflow and venting in these important spaces. 
the HW300 also uses sound alarms to promote safety. As the machine gets ready to work or move, a horn will sound prior to the start of the cutter module or before the machine begins tramming. Service work can be performed on the track system during mining. A push button is depressed on the front super beam to disable the tram circuit. The track drives are equipped with spring set and hydraulically released brakes. The hose reel has the same safe configuration. Other safety features, like the extra low profile cutter module grease take up cylinders, reduce the effort, time and equipment needed to adjust and tension the chain. The front of the machine has a guard to redirect blowback in the unlikely event of a methane explosion underground. While not certified as FOP structures, the overhead steel plate structure enhances safety for those working at the front of the machine. Automatic fire suppression that is specific to electrical controls and hydraulics is installed in the housing compartment. In addition, the machine ships with manual fire extinguishers positioned around the machine. Everywhere you look, the CAT HW300 High Wall Miner is built for safety.